In American culture, we've often downplayed diplomacy. This anti-intellectual strain in American culture is one of the difficulties for understanding how diplomacy and science uh, should work. Picture a Venn diagram, two circles, many circles if you wish, but populate all those circles with the values and interests of each group. And you will find that those circles overlap. And where they intersect, you find the common values and the common interest and the common principles that those groups share. And in diplomacy, you start there. Even if it's a tiny little area, you start there and you find ways to try to build on that space and expand it. In today's world, as we know, all science is also politics. Knowing what is right to do is not enough to solve a problem. It's knowing how to take what is right to do and convince a public, a government, a citizenry that this is what they would like to do. That is the challenge. We can take this truth as rock bottom in human society that with communication, people can and do seek out a better solution than the one they would have picked if they were not able to communicate with each other.